Got yet another war game to add to my massive growing pile. Um, I actually haven't done an uh, unboxing in a while, um, and I've actually picked up several games since. Maybe I'll do a, a run of unboxing videos. But today is DVG's newest Lanzarath Ridge, which takes place during the Battle of the Bulge. It's part of the Valiant Defense series of games. This is number four. The other ones they did, they did uh, Soldiers in Postman's Clothing, or maybe it's the other way around. I think that revolves around maybe the Polish invasion, I'm not sure. The most well-known is Pavlov's House, which was about a, a couple squads of Russians that were holed up in like an apartment complex, basically, that was just getting shelled and pounded and assaulted by Germans for like two or three weeks, or maybe a full month. They did Castle Eater, which was also a very weird battle where you saw French resistance, prisoners, American soldiers, German army, all fighting against a bunch of SS that were holed up in a castle. And then there's Landreth Ridge. Uh, on the opening day of the Battle of the Bulge, December 16th, early in the morning, there were 20-ish guys. It was 18 or 22 guys, and they weren't frontline combat troops. They weren't, it wasn't easy company or, or you know, the World War II equivalent of SEALs or Delta Force. It was it was artillery spotters and radio men and uh, signal men and things like that. They were they were not frontline troops, and they were sitting in their their camp, their little base that they had set up. And uh, all of a sudden, literally 500 Germans came pouring in, and they held out for a day. They had I think one guy get killed. Everybody got wounded. The Germans finally captured them when Kampf Group of Piper showed up with the tanks and basically said, what are you guys doing? There's like 20 people up there. Go up there and get them. And they did because these guys did such a great job of run over here and fire a rifle, run over there to the other end and, and shoot a machine gun, run back to the middle and throw a grenade that the Germans thought they had a couple hundred Americans up there defending this ridge. So we'll go ahead and get it open. This is a 100% solo game. So we've got the rule book. which is uh, full color. I really like the board. This was on a Kickstarter, I believe, in January of 2022, and it is end of September 2022. Yeah, here's the board. Set this over here to the side. The artwork on the board I really like. It's kind of a, it's a winter theme, obviously. It's a wide board. Thing. So this table that I use is a three by three table. So it's almost three feet wide by, oh, about 18 inches. So it's 18 by 34. That is a, a very nice board and it is, it is mounted. Okay. We've got defense phase, major action. Defense phase, minor actions, attacker phase, attributes and rules to remember. Those are all one-sided, so there's four player aid cards. My favorite part, tokens. We've got, uh, looks like three sheets of tokens. Not a million tokens, which is kind of nice. Uh, a lot of the games I've gotten recently have stacks and stacks and stacks of densely covered sheets covered in tokens. We have a bag of dice with uh, D6s, D8s, and D12s. Little wooden blocks of various colors. Brown, gray, some orange, some green, and uh, blue. And we have two cards. Tac tactics, attackers. Basically, the, the enemy, the Germans, you draw their cards to tell you what to do and the uh, stats and things for attacking. So, it's got a little cardboard tray in there. There's the back of the box. Oh, by the way, it is also, I was saying it's a solo game, it's a defensive game, and you have, it's a very individual level. You have the 18 or 22 guys on the American side, and then I'm not sure how they simulate the, the waves of Germans, but uh, we'll find out. I will probably do a playthrough video of this in the future, and I look forward to it. So, Landrath Ridge, Battle of the Bulge from DBG Games. Thanks for watching.